Hola, soy Susi. Hi guys, how are you doing today? Uh, welcome back to my channel. And today, as you can see, I have a very Mexican manicure, okay? Uh, I am celebrating the independence of Mexico. It is tomorrow, the 16th of September. Yay! <laughs> so, as you can see, I have several designs. I have a Talavera from Puebla. I have a cactus. I have also my beautiful flag. I also put a watermelon. And on my thumb, I have some flowers with black background. You will see it in a moment. So for this design I have three plates and the first one is this with a cactus. This is a plate that I have in my collection. I also found these with the seeds of the watermelon. And the third one I have this very intricate design that is like, you know, simulated Talavera. Okay, I'm gonna be using my clear stamper. I have my fast dry top, uh, coat top. Uh, my lint roller. I also have my base coat. Some cotton. Okay guys, so I also need a dotting or embossing tool. I used some acrylic paint in green, blue, yellow, white, and this uh, pretty bright orange. I love it. <laughs> Very bright. Um, I also use two nail polishes, black and white. This pretty pink polish as well by OPI and this is Pompeii Purple. Uh, I have China Glaze in Red Pearl. And this pretty green, this is for my flag. <laughs> this is Pure Eyes and the shade is Not Now. Okay, I'm gonna be using this uh, glitter nail polish to simulate the central emblem, which is an eagle devouring a serpent in the middle of our flag. So this is Glitz Ga Gal by Sally Hansen. And also I have these two uh, stamping polish by MDU in green and blue. Okay, step number one <laughs> is to apply base coat. Okay, the next step is to apply white nail polish in only three fingers, the pinky, the ring finger and the middle finger. Okay, in my index finger, I'm going to apply the pink nail polish. This is going to be for the watermelon. Okay, on my thumb, I'm going to apply some uh, black nail polish and I'm going to start making some flowers using the dotting tool. All right, so I have some acrylic paint uh, drops and with my dotting tool, I'm going to make the flowers and it's super easy. We just need five dots. One, two, three, four, five. That's it, that's your flower. Very, very easy. So in this case, I use this bright orange I'm gonna make one in yellow and the last one is going to be blue.
Okay guys, so I forgot to mention that we need some um, a tiny brush to make some lips. So we're gonna grab the green color and we're gonna put a dot and then we're gonna drag softly or pull the paint a little bit. And it doesn't have to be perfect, okay? This is just to make some lips. Now we're gonna be using white acrylic paint and we're gonna put a dot in the center of the flower to complete the design. So we're gonna let this dry completely before we put our top coat. Okay, now I'm going to apply my second coat in my um, index finger. This is going to be for our watermelon, all right? I am applying top coat. Uh, this is my fast dry top coat because I'm going to start stamping. But before stamping, I'm going to be working first on the flag, the Mexican flag. All right, to make the flag, I'm going to make a very thick band, a vertical band or a thick line in red and green and as you can see I am making a mess <laughs> but don't worry I'm gonna clean it with acetone Okay, now I am ready to stamp. I'm going to apply this beautiful design on my pinky. This will uh, simulate la, uh, the Talavera from Puebla, which is a beautiful city in central Mexico. And this is the design. It's very pretty. All right, the next stamp is this cactus. So I'm going to apply this image on my ring finger. Okay, I'm going to be using my dotting tool again and my orange acrylic paint and I'm going to put some flowers on the cactus so that it looks pretty. Alright, I'm going to apply a blob of glitter nail polish and this is going to be the central emblem of the flag. Okay, my thumb is completely dry so now it's time to put the top coat and this finger is ready to go. 
right now I am ready for the last design which is the watermelon and for this I'm going to use this plate with um, watermelon seeds so I'm going to stamp this in on my index Alright, and then with my green polish, I am going to apply this on the tip of my nail, like a French tip, and this is going to be the watermelon skin. Okay, so now I am ready to apply my top coat in all the fingers to protect the images and give that extra shine. And then we're gonna let it dry. And the last step, of course, is to put some cuticle oil. Okay guys, well that is all for today. I hope you guys uh, like this Mexican manicure. I really enjoy this a lot. And so, well, happy Mexico Independence Day to all my Mexican people out there, wherever you guys are. Receive my love and lots of blessings always. And viva Mexico. <laughs> and I will see you on my next video, okay? Bye.